It's the Winemakers on Sporting News, presented by Jack Daniels. Hey everybody, time now for one of our featured games of the week and who'da thunk it? Arizona hosting Philadelphia. The Eagles a four point favorite on the road. The total on the game is 43 and a half. Wow. Who'da thunk it? Uh-huh. Arizona 2-0 after shocking the NFL last week. Amazing, what a big win to go on the road. A 10 a.m. kickoff. These guys are used to just getting finished with breakfast at 10 a.m., not playing football, and that is a big deal. Talk about flying high. The Eagles have to be doing cartwheels. They're 2-0, and and they've done it in spite of themselves. But sometimes, Kenny, when you win ugly and you pull a win out when you're not playing your best, that says a lot about the character of a team, and you'll reap rewards for it down the road. I agree uh, wholeheartedly. This, this Eagle team, six interceptions by Michael Vick. He also fumbled the ball away. That seven turnovers are minus three on the year. But a 2-0 and start for a team who's yet to play their best football, they're doing cartwheels. Let's talk about the ATS. In relation to the wagering line, some pretty significant numbers for Andy Reid. Andy Reid a little better than uh, 500 ATS on the road against the spread number. But he's over 15-10 and 10 as the away team the last three years. And Coach Wisenhut for the Cardinals, another over guy. 14 and 10 and one tie to the over for Wisenhut at home. Hey, are we uh, heading somewhere with this? I think, you know, we got to look at the over in this spot. The total's 43 and a half. Does that move? I think the total, the total came down a half. I think it may go back up game day when they watch these two play. Arizona went under last week with the Patriots. That was a pathetic game. I think they'll be better offensively this week. Cobb goes against his old team, the Eagles. Whoa, a little motivation for both guys. Uh, let me just ask you about the turnover problem. That can be a double-edged sword. That can lead to a lot of short fields and a lot of points unless they're fumbling on the way in. Yeah, it all depends on where that turnover does happen. But I'm sure Andy Reid has cleaned things up this week, and he's probably demanding that the Eagles take care of the football. Letdown spot for Arizona and a long trip for Philadelphia. Which one wins out? Um, well, I don't know if it'll be a big letdown. Cobb will want this game badly. It's against the Eagles. Uh, always the Cardinals want to win. Maybe a bigger game to look at. Philadelphia just played the hard-hitting Ravens. All right, let's cut to the chase. What do you think? What do you like? I'm going to go over. Let's go over. Both guys show the trend to go over. Ditto. Uh, it seems like the smart play over the 43 and a half from the line makers on Sporting News when Philadelphia visits Arizona.